Welcome back to another episode of Irumakun. It's been a while, but I am back. We're going to finish off Season 1. We're going to get into Season 2, and we're going to try to catch up as fast as we can because Season 3 has already started. Goddamn. But what happened last time? Um, the outcome of the awards, we didn't win. But we did win, but we didn't win, like, the regular awards. But Kalego still ranked us up. Iruma is now tied with... No, he just got one rank, so he's like rank three now, right? Is that what Clara is, I think? So we're tied with Clara, but I'm sure Clara is just going to keep on getting higher and higher because I feel like she's just going to keep leeching off of Asas, and Asas is just going to continue to go up too. And then we had a little bit of father-in-law. So the story is really still pushing to uh, the, the, the main ship being Iruma and Amiri, and I'm all for it. It's just Clara is so special. She's so precious, but Amiri is... Uh, I don't know. I don't know how it's gonna pan out. Henry, the dad, is pretty funny, but the most the most important thing that really stood out to me was how humans are treated in the demon world. The school anthem, right, that played in that episode, Iruma was like singing along with it, as if everything was kind of normal, and they even made it to the point it out. Oh, Iruma was like, oh wait, I'm singing the, these ridiculous lines now, like, humans are to be eaten, like, these kind of lyrics kind of depict humans to be treated very unfavorably in the demon world but when henry was talking about i'm not sure no it was a bluff but it was like a real case about a past human that was here he wasn't treated that way in fact they went out of their way to make sure that the human was returned to earth in a very safe way and erased their memory there's a bit of a there, there's a bit of an offset here i think there's something going on behind the scenes of how humans are really treated in the demon world versus you know what it seems to be based off of the school anthem and such I don't know, but that's probably more for the lore that's going to be shown later. And then we got bailed out by Amiri just saying, Iruma, that's, uh, we're, we're talking about love and romance, uh, love and romance, right? Relationships. Yes, yes, father. That's what we were doing, not reading Shoujo manga, because if we were to get found out, how would Henry react? Right now, probably shocked and probably would, you know, try to get Sullivan back and then try to enforce Iruma to be sent back to Earth. But I really feel like... Since we have the favor of Amity, maybe we can get the favor of Henry soon enough. We'll find out though. Let's start today's episode. There's the idol! Okay! The idol is, you know, that girl, right? That keeps... Kuromu. Kuromu. She looks different from the girl that wears the glasses, but... You know, facial structure, hair shape... Looks kind of similar, doesn't it? So is this her, like, alter persona? I bet she's not always like that, huh? She's probably deep inside... Well... The thing about idols is that they wouldn't always want to be shown like this, right? So she's hiding, or maybe she's hiding this face behind what she truly is. is like a very gloom and shy and nervous, that, that gray hair girl in class, right? Stress period. Huh? The evil cycle when they just want to be demons. And then, them idol... Kuromu helps them release that stress. Oh, yeah, they got sports and video games, so it's stress relief. But this is probably not what Bal and Kiriwa wants. They want them to be more stressed and go back to the old days. <laughs> They're so nervous. This reminds me of uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Toto Aoi going to... Uh, I forgot the idol's name, but that huge girl every time <laughs> she goes... <laughs> it's the funniest running gag. But if Iruma was to show up, yeah, I mean, she has to do her job. Oh, curse you got. Not that I'll remember you, but you better come back. <laughs> okay, she's by herself. Let's see. Is this a wig or is this just magic? It. Since episode one, I've been on this the entire time. The moment Iruma suplexed, got on the newspaper, and this girl walked along the side and was always pissed off looking at the newspaper. I think it was quite obvious, but they've made multiple points to show her like that, pissed off whenever she saw the newspaper. You are not like this at school. You are so different. <laughs> what do you mean this is your outfit? While she's posing, will someone come in? What's her alias then? What is, what's her name that she goes in her class? Because she can't call herself Kuromu here. Ah, it's cool. <laughs> Exposed. <laughs> this is the most lines we've ever gotten ever. Actually having episodes of her though. Near the end of the season. Like, 
They saved her till the end of the season for this, huh? I mean, I guess it's a job. She's getting paid for it. But who put her up to this? <laughs> I'm so damn cute. Yeah, 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 you are. So, I guess she's happy doing it. That's good. Who scouted you out to be the idol? Oh, just by walking? I mean, she's pretty cute, yeah. I guess, yeah. She has that aura to be an idol, I guess. Oof. Like grown ass men like proposing to her. Everyone was around for her. And always bring her kids. Even you? If you oh no, the ice cream! I'll get you a new one. Don't worry. You can't get mad at her. Come on. Let's go get you a new ice cream. <laughs> Ability to counter malice. Is this just her natural charms or is this her magic? Being cute can defeat violence. Uh, to a certain extent, yes. But I wonder if being cute could defeat Bal's intent to destroy Babilis. Okay, she's not forced to do it. <laughs> yeah. So she's jealous of the rankings. Obviously, if you're in this kind of like entertainment business and you want to be... On the headlines every time. You you get pretty jealous, I guess. Keep myself at the lowest rank so she won't stand out. Hmm. So she... Interesting strategy that you're going at. She's intentionally nerfing herself in like... You know... Not going high rank, even though that is the entire point to become higher ranked than her mom to get back at her, I guess. But she has her own method of doing this. Eh. <laughs> this is a little bit of a cut. Not, I mean, this is an actual performance, right? Like the... What, what was it called? The uh, musical, like, uh, whenever Clara's family is involved. <laughs> <laughs> this is pretty much the idol culture in Japan. It's, it's mimicking it. It's pretty cute. They're watching the live stream. <laughs> but guys, I wonder where Kerori is, huh? Whenever Kurumu's on screen, Kerori isn't here. <laughs> this dedicated squad of the, <laughs> the light. <laughs> oh, that dance is always so funny. You know what? <laughs> Did you see Clara though? Did you see Clara beside? Clara's so into the dance. Uh, Clara doing that dance is exactly how like all the weebs. Well, I guess there aren't weebs if they're doing, you know, actually going to 2D concerts, but that's the dance. Yiruma Sama. Whoa. Hello. Oh, you won. To meet Kurumu. Just Yiruma, huh? Okay, this is my guess. Iruma and Kuromu is gonna have a one-on-one. -on -one. He's gonna somehow figure her out, right? He has to. Let's see how this works. She's so upset at this. No, no, I, I think that this relationship... It's gonna start off rocky, but then it's gonna get better, because they're gonna get... <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, no ice magic! Uh, you're... Kerori? Is that you? Are you using ice magic right now? Does he know? Does- you're slipping. Yo, 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 hello, hello? <laughs> wow, that's a lot of- That's kinda- That's a busy schedule. And you go to school too. Where? Which class? Shh. Almost slipped. You know, we've never seen Kerori like this or even had many scenes of her. Personality is quite explosive. The glasses, I guess she wouldn't reckon- Well, if the wig falls off. If the wig falls off, then it'd be really bad. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, how do you know mine? <laughs> she keeps slipping. <laughs> yes, that's the T, not the Iruma. Uh, I didn't know your name was Iruma. That's the name of the T. Sure, sure, sure. Somehow he didn't figure it out, but... Uh... See you at school. See you at school. What do you mean, at school? Where, huh? <laughs> Welcome back in here. What do you mean? No one. Don't tell anybody. Oh, why'd you take your wig off, you dummy? You're revealing your own secrets. Did he actually? F so he did figure out you were a classmate. 
Okay, she, he did. Okay. Pants. Mm. True, she was always like that. You noticed that. And Kuromu was also doing the same thing. On the stage, you noticed that? Pay attention to detail. And the ice. Okay, the, the other things too. The glasses, the ice. But, wow. That was a... Other than the most obvious things... Damn, I, I never would have thought that you don't stand. <laughs> Is that? That's a backhanded comment, to be honest. It's like you're here, but you're not. <laughs> well, the glasses, I guess, kind of attributes to that, but. Please teach me. This is such an underhanded comment, man. Like, I get what he's saying, but when you word it like that, you're so good at not standing out, like. You're gonna pass out at this rate. Can you at least turn the ice off? <laughs> oh, she, she just fucking caused a blizzard here by herself and gave herself a fever. But also maybe she's been like overworking. Ah, she... Kind of, yeah. Yeah, we did. She can't handle heat. She can't... Or uses too much ice magic. That's kind of ridiculous that if she uses too much ice magic, she just collapses. I guess it's like a... Ice magic is probably kind of OP, so it's like a way to control that OP-ness. Ice facade, bloodline ability, okay. Ice power is very strong, but... Huh. Never smiling. Their personality is also affected by this. But you're pretty smiley ever since you know went out by herself. Grandma? Aw, grandma. The dem dolls. Green hair That can't be Clara's mom, right? Could you imagine if that was actually Clara's mom or something? Yo <laughs> it, that's not Clara's mom, is it? No, it can't be. That'd be really hype if it was though. And maybe that would explain why they're always doing musicals as a family. Amity. Amity should be a dem doll. I mean, it should be a damn doll. If somehow she saw Iruma with Kuromu like this. The jealousy. Ooh, the jealousy. Ooh. I kind of want to see it happen, though. <laughs> Man, he's like, this is so cool. I've never been here before. <laughs> Come on, get involved. <laughs> Another let's work harder. Thanks, mom. Pretty sad flashback. I want her. I want her to get a good, you know, good job sticker too, man. Mm, could could she reach their icy hearts? Just want you guys to smile and show some, you know, affection. Maybe though. Maybe one day. No. What did Iruma do? Is Iruma going on stage as her? No, that's too much. No, that would never happen, right? Wait, 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 then who's performing right now? Mm. No, I think Iruma might have done something, but I... What's the possibilities here? Iruma went there, dressed up as Kuromu, or... Iruma just went there by as himself? Oh my god, what a... They? Is it multiple people on stage? The manager seems pretty pleased with this. She said that Yuma can't do anything in this situation, but what did he do, man? Is he actually on stage as her? What's the talent going on? I can't even... Is Claire doing some shit? What's going on? Is the trio up there or is it just... <laughs> So you do a dick on face like that? Oh the <laughs> Oh god <laughs> so good. It's so good. Fantastic idea. Great save, great save. Oh god. <laughs> oh, god. <laughs> we are Irumi and our merry best Alright, it's Irumi now. We're amateur talent, we're opening opening acts, come on. 
be nicer. Is this really gonna be like, oh, I don't recognize Iruma because it's... Uh, who's, who's Irumi, huh? Because of the wig and the dress. <laughs> Hello. Give me snacks or I'm gonna eat you. <laughs> Cute as usual. <laughs> I'm just smiling yet, but cool Alice. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? More lines? Come on, say it. Come on, say it. Well, it's, it's probably some ridiculously embarrassing life. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> he is the daughter. Sorry, he is the son of the Milfa seduction. And is Amiri really not going to recognize Iruma like this at all? I'm the shy little Iruma. <laughs> My weight, height, and personal personal top secret. <laughs> oh my god. But no one's gonna recognize. Iri Amiri, really? You're not gonna recognize her? I guess it's maybe better this way. Dangerous. Dangerous. It's, it's uncanny how good he looks in that. <laughs> Is this a Nico Nico Ni? <laughs> We're the opening act. Come on. You gotta get ready for her after. <laughs> this is just. What's going on? Clara just banging the fucking drums and we're just shooting fire at Irumi. I, I guess it's a fun act though. Show me Amiri's reaction. With the fire eye. <laughs> Do you recognize? Hmm. Come on, come on, come on! Yes. Also, he's the main character, so he always ends up standing out regardless, because that's how the author's writing. But yes, it's for his friends, yeah. <laughs> Cause he ain't no demon. She's gonna actually show her- Is Kurumu allowed to show her powers like that? Kurumu? Is she gonna show up in her without the wig, maybe? Cause you're not- We're not supposed to show the magic. This is all- Okay, I- I guess we can show- I know, it's all stage prop, it's not our magic. Yeah, it's, it's all stage prop, yes. Okay, we did reach her heart. We're on good terms now, right? Now we're out, no. Always grabbing by the ahoge. Irumi, Kuromu. They're not chanting Clara and as as his name, but Irumi is quite popular. They're gonna be they're gonna be wondering who could Irumi be. A double performance with Kuromu and Irumi. Maybe they'll be on the top of the ranking board together this time. Wait, you memorize the lines? You memorize these lines? It's squeaky! <laughs> you know, they're in sync. They're perfect so getting Clara just being Clara. Oh my god. Ameri, I, 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 Ameri, you better be doing this too with the, with the lights. This is... You slay me! <laughs> oh my god. Irumi really memorized and like all the choreography too. But I really wonder. Could, could the person that oh there's not many going hard. But could the person that you know uh, Kuromu sorry Kerori was inspired by by when Granny showed her about the Dem dolls, could it really have been Clara's mom, man? Man, I don't know. It's just the green hair. But whenever Clara's on stage like this too. Kinda, it's just the green hair. It's just the green hair. Unless... Great job, little imp. More importantly... Hmm? Her family showed up? Really? Did... Wow, I thought it would take too long for them to show up. The fuck? <laughs> Take care of yourself. Wait, is there a good job? I mean, it's not a good, but it's a smiley sticker this time, though. Oh, it's a smiley sticker this time. We did it. We did it. We don't have to outrank Mother anymore. There's no vengeance plot. No. But I thought the whole entire thing about we can't get her family here in time was, well, I guess we couldn't by 606, but I thought they were really far away. Yeah. Did they watch? Did, did, did they watch the performance, though? And? And? 
we would smile. We get so worked that we pass out. <laughs> Meaning they totally approve. We'll be chugging. As usual, they've been watching from home. No. <laughs> oh, it's a good family after all. I thought they were some kind of evil family, but no, they were nice after all. So, um, want to do it again? Another friend. Plus one. We have an idol as a friend now. I'm surprised they really can't recognize Iruma from the front page like that. Like, look at the way the arms are going out. Like, guys, the, who does it look like? Clara is just Clara. I wonder who Clara hangs out with. Even the back page, Irumi's hair, long hair isn't even, like, showing. It's like, come on, it's so obvious. The mysterious trio. Gee, I wonder who could it be, but all right, let's play dumb then. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> My heart doesn't seem to. I guess he doesn't roll that way, but. Oh, big fan of Irumi, huh? Don't worry. Like, look at this. This is just entirely Iruma, huh? And that's the episode. So that was two quick episodes of, I guess, um, Kerori's idol dem doll arc, but. Again, top of the dem doll world means there's other dem dolls around, but maybe that's not the point to kind of showcase. So maybe it's just, I don't know, Kuromu's number one right now. And I mean, she she already pretty much finished her story arc because her family is, you know, happy and been watching from home the entire time. So there's no like, I, I must like uh, hide my rank in the darkness that one day when I'm done with this, I can rise up to the top and, you know, outrank my mother and show her that like my path is also righteous. It's like, no, they've been supporting you the entire time at home. Oh, one thing that I, I regret or I wish that happened was Amity realizing that it was Iruma and just getting so flustered over it, but unfortunate maybe it's for the best that the mysterious trio remains a mystery we have one more episode left and then we're on to season two so gotta get on that schedule but hey if you stick around this song and if you'd enjoy my reaction you already know what i'm gonna say check out the other videos and playlists on my channel if you watch another video immediately after this one it helps you to go push my small channel to be recommended so that i have a chance to compete with some of your favorite reactors until next time guys take care